Hey, hope you're well. There's been a lot of sort of movement uh, changes amongst the microstock companies that are getting involved and getting out of selling AI generated content. So I thought now would be a great time to provide a bit of an update and let you know which uh, stock agencies are currently selling AI generated content. So let's just get right into it. Uh, the biggest and uh, the most important of the sites that you can upload AI generated content to is Adobe Stock. This is the industry leading stock agency, uh, probably bigger now than Getty, probably bigger than Shutterstock, uh, but they allow AI images and they have since sort of this all started and it's one of the top selling sites for me and it's my personal focus. The second site that I'm gonna to bring to your attention is Dreams Time. Dreams Time is another fairly well-established agency. They are allowing AI images and have been kind of from the beginning as well. Uh, I have uploaded some there and I do have AI related sales there, but it's not a big focus for me right now. Still, Dreams Time might be a good option for you. The third agency that I wanted to talk about is 123RF. 123RF allows AI generated content to be uploaded and sold. I have not uploaded anything at 123RF, but it's something that you should look at. From my perspective, it's a site that uh, I have a lot of experience with on the photograph side, and it's a weak site that sells very little. That said, I don't have much experience on AI images, so check out 123RF. The next site that I'm gonna talk about here is a site that's pretty new to selling AI generated content. I haven't really checked it out that much, but uh, they have announced they are gonna start taking images and that is Vecteezy. I have no experience with selling any assets on Vecteezy, uh, but it is an option. And uh, depending on your workflow, uh, it's good to sort of spread stuff around to all the different agencies. Okay, the next two sites that I'm gonna talk about are sites that basically allow you to upload content and then they distribute that content out to a number of agencies uh, so you only have to upload once. Uh, there's a uh, downside to those agencies because they typically uh, take part of your earnings or charge some sort of fee. The first one of these agencies is a site called Wirestock. Wirestock allows you to submit and sell direct AI images, and then it also distributes to other agencies like Adobe Stock uh, on, on your behalf. They take a 15% commission on your sales on those other sites, uh, but they also charge a monthly membership fee. I believe it's 10 US dollars a month, and that is a substantial amount. Uh, so uh, something that you really wanna consider before uh, deciding whether it's right for you. Uh, the next site is very similar. Different economic model, however, it's called Cavan Images. They are accepting AI generated content and then they'll distribute out as well, also allowing you to sell direct through their platform, depending on your, uh, your membership model. The economics here again are uh, something that you'll need to investigate for yourself, but generally they take a 50% cut if you're a free member and if you're a paid member, uh, it's a little different, um, but still it's a, it's, a tough, it's a tougher model. And I know from experience with photographs that Cavan Images is a bit more selective in the content they take. So uh, those are the sites that are allowing AI generated content uh, to be uploaded and sold to buyers. Um, hopefully this was helpful and we'll see you on the next one. Take care.